Hey, I bought two cool parachutes at the market. This is just the perfect purchase for me and JJ because we really love all kinds of extreme adventures. I can even show you how it works. Now you just need to climb higher and jump. This place looks good for a jump, but no, too low. Then I'll show you when we jump from the plane. For now, I'll go and tell JJ about my brilliant plan. He will definitely be happy. He's probably playing on his computer again and won't even notice me. I will find you and cut your internet cable. Maybe then you can start playing. Oh, hi, Mikey. What did you come? Is there something to do? I bought us a parachute at the market. In general, I suggest jumping from a plane into them. I've already booked a couple of planes for us, so let's go. Of course I agree. Let's go jump. I'm always ready for that. This is very good because they would have charged us a big fine if they hadn't come. Look, JJ, we're at the airport. We were allowed to fly straight from here to the landing field. There are cars there that will take us to the planes. Wow, quite a clever plan for getting to the planes. There must be very cool planes there if they are hidden so far away. Yes, I bought the best planes so that we can jump from the maximum height. In general, let's just sit down and let's go. Otherwise, there's also a fine for being late. I can't seem to start your car. That means you'll run to the planes. Come on, in general, think quickly. And I moved on. And here are our long-awaited planes. In general, they are single-seaters. I didn't have enough money for one large plane, and I also need to order a pilot there. In general, friends, we will jump like this on our own. Time to start my flight. The engine is started and warmed up so there will be no problems. All you have to do is fly to the right place and have a beautiful parachute jump. Yes, great! The altitude is gradually gaining. All instruments are in order, so you can fly further. I hope JJ has already taken off and we will arrive at the place in a moment. Oh, Mikey had already flown away while I was going to the toilet. Okay, not so scary. Now I will squeeze the gas to full and catch up with him without any problems. Still, I am a professional pilot with a world license. Mikey booked some really fancy planes. I really like driving it. So I gained altitude and almost reached the desired landing point. So it's time to jump. The parachute will open on its own after a couple of seconds of free fall. And all I can do is rejoice and look at the beauty. The nature here is amazing. I would hang in the air like this all my life, but it's expensive and hard. So let's enjoy the moment. The picture is spoiled a little by the local fog, but I like it even better. I just feel a strange swaying in the parachute. What is this strange sound? Oh no, I'm falling. Oh my God, the parachute broke. So the height is a kilometer. The outside temperature is normal. Judging by the instruments, you can already jump. So let's fly. Wow, what an interesting feeling from free fall. The parachute opens too quickly. But okay, at least you can look at the beauty here. To this beautiful forest and rivers. Didn't understand. What are those sounds? What? Oh no, I'm falling. Oh, how strange I feel. Stop, it is me, JJ. Why are you now lying on the ground and standing in front of me at the same time? I don't understand Mikey myself. I was just falling with a parachute. It broke and I fell to the ground. I woke up here. It looks like you and I have become ghosts. This simply cannot be. We can't become ghosts like this. I have a lot of unfinished things to do. That's how I finished the second grade of school. Cool. Hey, who else are you? What kind of weird costume is this? Hi guys, I am Death. In general, I see you are young and still full of energy. We weren't even very desperate about what happened. I give you an attempt to escape. Here's a test ball for you. Activate it, and if you pass the tests, you will return to your bodies. Wow, thank you. JJ, we were lucky, of course. Then let's use the ball and return everything to how it was. Really? Let's start the test already. Yeah, that's a test. Looks like today I have to conquer my evil side. They gave me an ax, so I'm ready to cut through everything bad in myself and become good. Get over it, villains. Now there won't be a trace of you left in this world. Come on, JJ, break their faces. We definitely need to defeat them in order to be saved. I understand this and do what I can. They turned out to be very weak, probably because I have been doing spiritual practices for the last few years. I don't see these enemies anymore. Maybe they hid or maybe they don't exist anymore, as I promised. Looks like we really were able to defeat them all. Well, good. Then Mikey ran away from here. Here is the hidden portal. Right behind these doors, a portal awaits us. Or there's another test. Let's hope for the former and run faster. Wow, 
JJ, we did it. That guy didn't deceive us, and after actually passing the test, we were able to return to our bodies. Hooray! Oh, how tired I am at work. I return in the evening, so it's time for me to eat, so I need to see what we have in the refrigerator. So slowly and steadily, we approach the victim. Oh, we only have rotten meat here. Okay, I'll eat it. There's no choice anyway. I hope I don't get poisoned by this masterpiece. Oh, what tasteless food. I won't eat anything like that again. In general, I'll go to bed. Otherwise, I have a lot to do tomorrow. It's my birthday tomorrow, so it's going to be an amazing day. I wonder how my friends and my wife will congratulate me. I hope something unusual and useful. I want a computer. Oh, how quickly the morning came. And I am surprisingly cheerful and strong. I felt as if I had become light, like I'm a spirit or something. Said funny, of course. I don't see my wife and friends. It's probably too early for a gift for me. So it's time to be in my pool. It's very strange that at this time, Mikey still hasn't woken up. I didn't see him leave the room somewhere so we need to wake him up. Mikey, are you there? Hey Mikey, hi. Wake up quickly, I prepared breakfast for you. Hey Mikey, are you waking up? What happened to you? There doesn't seem to be any temperature. Oh no, we need to quickly ask JJ for help. He knows exactly what to do in such cases. Or maybe it's Mikey's norm to sleep so hard that you can't wake him up. Hmm, there is a strange, unpleasant feeling. Like something will happen. Oh, who came there? Oh, hi, have you decided to come early to get ready for Mikey's birthday? Hi, no, I need your help. Mikey is lying there in bed and I can't wake him up. He has some kind of low temperature. Come follow me. Oh no, I hope he's just sleeping very soundly as usual. Oh, I finally hear someone's steps. They're probably coming to congratulate me. Guys, wait, I'm here and not in the room. Hey, didn't you hear me? Strangely, I told them this quite loudly. Okay, I'll go into the room and scare them. So you see, he lies there and doesn't wake up at all. I do not know what to do. What? Is that me lying? What kind of jokes? Guys, can't you see me? Hey, JJ, can you hear me, friend? Listen, it seems to me that I feel a strange presence of someone here, as if Mikey is telling us something, or it seems to me. I do not understand what you're saying. Here, Mikey lies and shows no signs of life. What should I do? They don't seem to see or hear me at all. So now I'll call the doctor and you wait. Fine. Oh no, Mikey, hang in there. I believe that you are still with us. Just wait for the doctor. But I'm already here. Honey, can you hear me? How can I reach you? What should I do without you? Good afternoon. I was told that your guy here is feeling bad and he can't get out of bed. Yes. He's been lying there for an hour now and hasn't woken up. We tried our best to wake him up, but there was no result. Only the man heard some of his words, but I didn't hear anything. I see he's no longer at all. And the pulse is very low. I can no longer help here. Unfortunately, you just have to wait a couple of hours and call another service. Now I'm able to move around a little. I'm alive. But that doesn't happen. He was completely healthy yesterday. He came late at night and went to bed. I'm sorry, but I have to go. And today it's like that. I just don't believe it. Don't be afraid. I will find a way to get back here. Okay, there is nothing left for us. Just dig a hole and put a cross. Nothing can be done about him anymore. Okay, I prepared the materials for the cross in advance. I don't really have a lot of them, so it won't be that big. This is how it will work out somehow. That's enough, thanks for the help. That's all, it's the end of me. And who else are you? Hello, my young friend. What a pity that you are leaving so early. But you know, I have a test for you. If you pass it, then I will return you to your body. And if you don't pass, then you have nothing to lose. Here's your ball of fate. He himself will direct you to the right place, and then everything depends on you. Wow, cool. Well, then I'm ready to try my luck and return to my body. Oh, what a simple test I had. I'm a master of sports and sports, so now I won't notice this giant zombie. They also gave me an axe. I would even beat him with my bare hands. It's not for nothing that JJ and I went through so many different battles. These skills were very useful. So wait for me, friends. Oh. It's a waste of time for me to throw around such words. The guy turned out to be quite persistent. It seems that in the body of the spirit, I have much less strength and endurance. So I have to take short breaks to restore power and finish off this giant. Hooray, it was quite difficult, but I completed the task. I hope now I can get into my body and there will be no second test in this portal. Forward. Hooray, it looks like I got into my body. I feel alive. 
I need to get out of this hole before I get buried. Hi guys, I'm alive. JJ, look back and see who's behind. What kind of jokes are you making? Who's there? Ooh, hi, my friend. You're still alive. Yay, we're so glad you woke up. Hi, guys, I'm so glad to see you. And here is Mikey's house with JJ. Now I'll quietly make my way to their house, knock on the door, and when one of them comes out to see who came, I'll just knock him out. If the two of us go out, it will be more difficult, but I can handle it. Hmm, as always, boring lines of code have to be written at night. What are these sounds? Or it seemed to me as if there was a knock on the door or something. We should check what we have here. I don't see anything special in the backyard. It must have been someone knocking on the front door. JJ probably didn't hear since he didn't go to open it. Very strange, but I don't see anything or anyone here. Only it looks like they forgot to close the door from the yard. Maybe someone snuck into our yard and is playing jokes. I should check out what's here. But I don't see anything strange at all. Hey, is anyone here? And here comes Mikey. He doesn't even know what awaits him now, but it's temporary. Hi, Mikey. You are so inattentive. Pay for it. Hey, who are you? Oh, no need. Help, JJ! Oh, what is that sound? Why do I hear requests for help from Mikey? Also on the street? Hey, Mikey, are you there? Or it seemed to me, maybe. The door to the courtyard is open. Mikey couldn't scream and run away. He's probably in the backyard. Mikey, are you there? JJ, I'm here, or didn't you recognize me? Then I have no choice but to beat you. Hey, who are you? Ouch, it hurts. Two hours later. Oh, where did I end up? And what happened to me? For some reason, everything hurts, and it's very strange. Although, wait, I remembered I was attacked by some maniac. He probably threw me into a room with this parkour, and now I have to go through it to free myself. Pretty simple parkour. The main thing is to run and jump in time. Ah, but it doesn't always work out. With this attempt, I will definitely be able to complete this parkour. I don't remember how many days I spent here, but I don't intend to give up. Because the weak give up, and I am a little stronger than the weak. In general, everything is really simple here. But due to the number of jumps, I can't go through them all at once. Only luck will help me get through and not fall at the last moment. I feel that today, I will succeed. I'm lucky even now. I could have fallen to the very beginning, but I only fell one level down, which means we're trying again. What a shame it is to fall. My strength is leaving me, but I can't give up. Maybe Mikey is trapped now, and I'm wasting so much time here. So for the sake of it, you need to gather your strength and finish it. For some reason, the beginning and end of parkour are always the easiest. But in the middle, there is some kind of chaos. But he is far behind, so we can start to rejoice. I see a button on the wall so we can get out of here. Oh, where am I? What am I even doing in some strange room of corridors? Just don't say that I'm in a labyrinth. It looks like this maniac decided to force JJ and me to take tests. But it's okay now, I'll quickly go through these labyrinths and find him to give him back. The maze doesn't look particularly complicated, so I couldn't cope with those kind of things. I just need to walk along the inside of the wall, and I'll definitely go somewhere. This is how any labyrinth works. You just have to go and go without turning anywhere. So use my strategy while I'm alive. It seems my strategy has failed, and so far I don't see a way out of this maze. Then all that remains is to follow the tactics of geniuses. You need to break what has already been created and create something new from the ruins, which means we move on from the starting point. So, I already feel that I'm close to the exit. We need to turn here and here. There will definitely be a pressure plate or a button somewhere to get out of here quickly. I can smell her scent and go to her. And here she is. I can finally leave here. I don't like it here so much that I won't even linger too long. Oh, hi, JJ. How are you doing? Where had you been? I was doing some parkour, but it is not important. You and I ended up in some strange room with lasers. At the end, I see a way out. This means we can only jump through the lasers and have to go straight through one. So see how I can do it and then just repeat after me. This laser doesn't even hurt that much. So run and don't be afraid. I'm waiting for you upstairs. Okay, if JJ could do it, then I can too. Here you just need to jump over these lasers and climb the stairs. I really don't know where it leads. Oh no, there's another laser waiting for me that I can't jump over. Then we go through it and leave the basement of our house. Wow, there is some kind of axe and a potion. What's ahead? Oh no, JJ, what's wrong with you? That means you did it to him. Now I will beat you for preventing us from living in peace. Get Maniac. 
I'm too angry to lose to you. Do you seriously think you can beat me? You're still too weak for this. How dare you even say such things to me? For this, I will beat you twice, you ill-mannered maniac. Get hit in the face. And here is my final blow. You'll know how to fight with a muscle man like me. So, you need to try this potion on JJ. Suddenly, it will revive him. Oh, it worked. Mikey, thank you for helping me deal with the maniac. I dropped things so you could win. I beat up a little maniac and you were able to finish him off.